Mawa faced Ramapo in the state tournament quarterfinals on Saturday. Both goalies were on their game. Ramapo took an early penalty. Dan Thompson asked for an explanation for the 2 and 10. Boomhauer made the stop. No penalty here. Or here. The Mawa head coach clearly disagreed. Penalty here. Boomhauer continues to stop everything. Soda's deflection goes just wide. No penalty here. But there are two penalties here. Boomer makes the stop. No penalty here. The second period ends 0-2-0. Zero zero. Dylan Roberts is called for head contact. Sophomore Joe Noonan down on the ice makes a spectacular pass to Luke May. So I curled out, got past the defenseman, and just went to take a low shot, and it just slid right through his legs. Ramapo battled back the entire third period with shot after shot. A couple of times it got away from me, but I still had to fight through it. And fight through it he did, stopping the Raiders' desperate efforts to get one by him. game plan for us. I thought they forechecked very hard. They came at us hard with the puck down in our zone, and we had trouble. First period, I thought was our worst period of the year. We scratched it, we sunk it, and then we came back in the second period. I thought we played much better. They gave us trouble on uh, on their breakout. We tried to neutralize it a little bit, and sure enough, Luke May, uh, you know, nothing new with Luke. Finds the back of the net every time. Mala, they played fantastic. They played the hard side, so, and Skinnell was fantastic. We go for them. But the, uh, in the second period, they called a few calls. In the third period, they made a call. When it's 0-0, zero, zero, you, you got to let them play. I'm proud of the guys. We gave it their all. And it's not like we lost because we weren't trying. We, uh, we just got beat. I asked the seniors in there to give some messages to the players, the undergraduates. And the two first words that came out was treasure every moment and never give up. <laughs> 